we know Flagship is a company focused on developing breakthrough technology platforms in the two areas that are most important to society, planet health and human health. And sustainability, we are focused in agriculture and nutritional health. Um, in agriculture, we are focusing our effort, efforts in accelerating the transition to a more sustainable system that is more respect, respectful with nature and the environment. And we are doing that by developing these technologies and these platforms that drama will dramatically reduce the use of water, fertilizer, chemical pesticides, and also reduce, uh, reduce greenhouse gas emissions. We have a sense of urgency to develop these platforms uh, with the ultimate goal of allowing us as humans to grow more food, uh, to feed a growing population, while also being much more respectful with nature and the environment. If there is no planet, there is no human health. The things that are really important, um, at least for, from my point of view in sustainability, are um, water and soil, uh, in particular as a kind of natural resources we need to grow food in this planet. 70% uh, of water is used in agriculture, around one third of the land on this planet is used for agriculture as well and for growing food. So um, the what if questions that we ask all the time are around these two topics and obviously others because the consequence of having these natural resources uh, or being more respectful with these natural resources that has implications in many other areas like greenhouse gas emissions and also uh, and related to the use of, uh, of humans to grow more food um, in a more efficient way. Uh, so everything that we are doing in all the four companies in bio, sciences, civil technologies, indigo agriculture or in ordinary agriculture is around uh, developing alternative approaches to reduce the use of chemicals, grow, uh, develop seeds that are more adaptable to climate change, um, developing digital platforms that make agriculture more efficient uh, and develop also solutions for uh, carbon. Uh, those are areas that we are very focused these days. Uh, and, and we think that there is a lot of work that we need to do, but we need to do it very, very soon. And, and we need to develop this technologies very quickly because we'll have no time to waste. Honestly, I, I grew up in a city in Spain called San Sebastian nothing to do with uh, farming. Um, but I met my wife uh, many, many years ago. Uh, she comes from a small town or a small village in England. Uh, her family are six brothers, all of them farmers. So I used to spend a lot of time on tractors, on the fields uh, and talking to them and being around uh, dinner tables with families of farmers and, and it was incredible, an incredible experience and I still do these days where every time we go to England. Uh, and that was kind of the first reason why I ended up in the agricultural world. The second one is uh, I was uh, working for a human biotech company and uh, I got a call um, and I, I, I went to Switzerland to meet a gentleman called Robert Brandes, who at the time was the, um, he was the head of uh, strategy and, and planning at Syngenta, which is, as you know, the biggest agrochemical company in the world. And he convinced me to join Syngenta. Uh, so I spent there five years and it was an incredible platform to learn about the agri agribusiness industry and the complexities, but also the, the, the urgent need we have as humans to develop uh, technologies to be one, um, more respectful to the environment, and second, to be more efficient uh, in the way we produce better food.